Now let's get a check of our next weather with Paul Deano. Not a lot of people are going to be getting outside to exercise today during the storm, I'm assuming. Yeah, it's going to be one of those days where you might want to hit the treadmill instead of heading outside. It's going to be soggy throughout the day. Just got our camera up at Wrightwood and happy to report that the snow is coming down. Uh, the precipitation is wonderful news there. I want to transition back to my weather computer to talk about the not so good news. There are flood advisories. One level above that is a flash flood warning. We now have that. It was just issued for the Long Beach area and it's not going to expire until 1115. This has been the bullseye for the past hour. More than an inch and a half of rain in a few spots over just the past 90 minutes. So that flash flood warning for Long Beach and we're going to head north into the San Fernando Valley and also the San Gabriel Valley where it continues to pour there. La Cañada, Flint Ridge, Altadena, Pasadena, Alhambra, San Marino all getting pounded with some very heavy rainfall. It's not everywhere, but it's in a lot of places. Inland Empire, soaking rain. Orange County, soaking rain. L.A. County, especially Long Beach, we're beginning to see the back edge of it move through western L.A. County and eastern Ventura County, but it is still quite soggy in many locations. Redondo Beach, more than two inches of rain just this morning. Malibu, nearly two. Oxnard, an inch and a half. Chatsworth, more than an inch. And it's now pouring in places like Corona and Anaheim coming up on one half of an inch of rain. A widespread urban flood advisory is in effect. That basically means street flooding, highway flooding, places where the ground is not a sponge because it's asphalt or concrete. Concrete. It's immediately runoff, and this will continue through 10 o'clock. Winter storm warning, Wrightwood, Big Bear, all of the mountains above 7,000 feet in elevation. It's been snow from start to finish. The snow level is going to drop this afternoon to 4,500 feet, and we could get a quick three to six inches of snowfall even there. Very drippy outside in Santa Monica. It is still raining steadily in downtown Los Angeles where it's 51 degrees. You may be wondering, okay, when's this going to be done? The steady rain in Orange County finishes between 10 o'clock and 11 o'clock. Then we switch over to showers. It's not going to get sunny and warm out. We'll get a little bit of sunshine in the afternoon. Scattered showers from 11 o'clock onwards. Some of those could be some pretty heavy downpours. Out of the entire West Coast dealing with this front, the heaviest rainfall is now in Southern California because we're tapping into the tropics and I'll show you more of that with our next storm coming up. Still messy between 8 and 10 o'clock in the Inland Empire, even as late as 1130. Uh, San Bernardino and Hemet and Temecula still dealing with heavy rainfall. Notice by 3 o'clock in the afternoon, some peaks of sunshine, but also some scattered showers, a tiny thunderstorm chance and scattered showers and downpours will continue even after sunset this evening. That's all storm number one, a break in the action tomorrow. Watch this on Saturday as Mother Nature is getting ready to bring more tropical moisture our way. You can follow the rain from west of us all the way out a couple thousand miles south of Hawaii. That's what we talk about when we say we're tapping into the tropics. That tropical moisture south of Hawaii is being pulled up into Southern California. And when it makes landfall, there will be a few spots that will get several inches of rainfall. One of those spots could be right over us in Southern California. As a matter of fact, computer models are suggesting long range. From now through this time next week, we could be looking at rainfall totals of four to seven inches. That is significant rain. Most of that falling, not today, but with the next storm. We're soggy this morning, showery this afternoon. We get a bit of a break Friday and Saturday. More rain coming for the Inland Empire Sunday through the middle of next week. It's a pretty wet pattern. Let's see how the roads are responding. Here's Kalina. Good morning.